Okay, Mona. Hi, Debra. Hi, everybody. First of all, uh, thank you, Debra, for making the time for all of us. Oh, My uh, question for the spirit guides is, uh, should I uh, start a business partnership with my sister? I mean, is it a good idea to start a project uh, with my sister to work with her? Okay, so Mona is considering a business with her sister. Is this wise? Is it the optimal choice for, Lo uh, for Mona, sorry? Is it the optimal choice for Mona to have a business with her sister? I'm getting a strong yes on that. So what makes you question it? I don't know. Uh, I don't work very well with her. This is why. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> so, okay, but I, I, I needed this. I needed this answer to start the project. So thanks a lot. So even though you don't work well with her, there's something that's drawing you to this project. So you're just going to need to work with her and compromise, come to a place where you can both agree on the direction. And it feels like, Mona, this is an opportunity to, for you to step into a better relationship with her because these are things that you've needed to work out for a very long time anyway. And the two of you, it's like, you know, when you have a team of horses, you've got two horses that are hitched together and they're pulling a wagon, they have to pull in the mm -hmm. same direction. It doesn't work otherwise, right? It's that unequal yeah. thing. So you can't both be going in different directions when you're hitched together. Yes, yes, you're right. Yeah, so what I'm getting is like, Mona, it's your choice what you want to do, but if you decide to do this business with her, remember you are hitching yourself to her wagon and the two of you are going to have to work this out for the mutual success and you can do it, but it's not going to be without yes. effort. Yes, I need to do some efforts on my side. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Debra. And it's a great opportunity for you. It's growth. I really needed to hear this. Awesome. Thanks. You're welcome.